Hey guys and gals, I think it's about time for another adventure. So, as I've been scrolling through Instagram lately, I've been seeing a lot of these yellow flowers that people take photos of here in Japan around this time of year, kind of like this here, where you have these fields of yellow, which are actually canola flowers, as it turns out. And a lot of these photos I found are taken in other parts of Japan. But as I continued to investigate, I found this park here in the south of Osaka, Izumi Recycle Environment Park, I think that's what this is. And there's like this pineapple looking tree in the background um, <laughs> and these fields of canola flowers, along with some sakura, which is probably too early for the cherry blossoms. But I'm gonna go down there and check it out and see if I can't get some like cool photos of these yellow flowers. And I'm gonna vlog the whole thing for you on YouTube. And we'll see if I can get some good photos or if it's gonna be a total dud. But I'm gonna bring along this gorilla pod that I picked up so I can do some, you know, some true vlogging like every vlogger has. And hopefully it's an interesting adventure. Let's go find out. It took me about 45 minutes to get down to Izumi Fuchu Station and I just used the Osaka loop line. So from here I'm going to take a drive because I have access to a car today and should take about 30 minutes to get to the park. So we'll see how it goes. Alright, so now, now we got a car and we're going to drive the rest of the way to the park. And today I'm joined by the lovely Mai who <laughs> Doesn't want to be on camera, but mm -hmm. she doesn't have a choice because she's the model for today's <laughs> photos. <Yeah. laughs> okay, we made one stop to get bubble tea. Now we're ready. Okay, we've pulled into the parking lot and we've made it in one piece, although I think it's gonna rain on us, so that'll change the mood of the photos, but uh, should be fine. Anyways, we'll find out in a minute. Mm. So move it. Okay, it's kind of cold and windy, but uh, there's all the canola flowers, so we found them. And then there's this famous like big pineapple behind me, which I kind of want to get into photos too. So I don't know how to do this. I think, I think we'll get, if I can get the canola flowers in the foreground, the pineapple in the background, and then I'll get some photos with Mai too, as she shakes her head, no, 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 no. Um, yeah, say hi. Hi. <laughs> okay, perfect. <laughs> Let's try this. <laughs> So this pineapple's in a pretty good spot behind these uh, yellow flowers, actually. And there's not too many people because it's kind of a rainy day, but there's like all these fields. So I can get Mai to stand in front of him in a minute, see if I can get some more shots. I just took a bunch of photos of the, the pineapple there with the flowers kind of like through them. And I think I should edit. I think I should be able to edit something interesting out of those. We'll see. I'll find out. But yeah, it's a nice spot. It's a bit windy, like I keep saying, but it's a good spot for photos, honestly. It's a cool little little environment park. <laughs> so apparently they're cutting all these uh, canola flowers down next weekend. So we were uh, giddy giddy safe. <laughs> we just barely made it in time 
because <laughs> uh, yeah, they'll be gone in a week. So, and then apparently there's still some plum blossoms that we can see. And my, when did he say tulips were ready? They said something about Tulip. tulips. Tulip. Yeah. Mm. The more when I didn't understand that part. Okay. Soon. 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 Okay. So there'll be tulips here soon. Um, but yeah, apparently you have to get here before mid-March if you want to see canola flowers in the future. And it's dirty. Hmm. Ah. So, so. That's the tulip fields over there. But they're not, uh, soon. And then, then, um, what was he pointing to? I didn't understand that either. Point okay. e something over here, yeah. No, like, um... Ah, yeah. <laughs> oh, you didn't understand yeah. either? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm most sure right. <laughs> okay. So, Mai didn't understand his Japanese either, so it wasn't just me. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> okay, let's go. This way is the plum flowers, right? That way to the, to the ume, no? Okay. Yeah, the, uh, we're a bit late for the ume down here. Yeah, it's kind of cute. This path would be really like, yeah. it'd be cute if there were still ume. No ume. Mm. Yeah, but I saw the ume at uh, Osaka Jo mm. a couple weeks ago when they were still in bloom. So this would be a good spot too in the future. There's like, there would be a lot of them. And then uh, behind all these ume gardens, there's like a Junkyard, I guess. I don't know if you can see that back there, but kind of kind of funny that behind all the flowers in the park is a. I guess this is an environmental recycling park. Makes sense. This next to a junkyard. <laughs> okay, it's starting to rain, so I think that's where we're gonna call it for today. So the weekend's over, and I'm back in my house here. I've gone through a bunch of the photos, and I got some I like. We end up getting rained out at the park in the end there, but um, it closes at five anyways, so we're kind of running out of time regardless. If you don't have a car, you can bus there from the station. It's, you know, it's about 30 minutes as well, so it's not too bad. I'm still going through some of the photos with the flowers and the pineapple, because they're a bit bland, <laughs> I think. I like the ones better with the subject in them, with my in the photos or with myself in the photos. One thing I wish I'd brought like a telephoto lens, because there's nowhere to really walk through. It's one big patch of flowers and there's no order to really walk through. So it would have been nice to kind of get some flowers in the foreground and us in the background more kind of like this. But I would have, I would have liked to have a telephoto lens to go like stand on opposite ends and, and just shoot all the way through. So I think that's something I would do in the future too. But yeah, I ended up, the pineapple's nice and I ended up liking this one tree off to the right side as well, just cause of the shape and it's just my taste. So yeah, there's some nice photos here with that tree in the background and kind of just my leaning in and picking the flowers. There's a bunch of benches in front of the flowers too. Like, so there's a photo of me here that I like where I'm just sitting on the bench, but the benches were really wet from it being rainy the day before. So um, if I brought a towel, maybe I would have like wiped those down and posed, posed more on the benches, but we couldn't sit on them too much as it was. I imagine on a sunny day, it's probably a bit more crowded too. I definitely want to make some more adventures around Osaka and my school is coming up on spring break, I guess, spring vacation. So I'm gonna go down to Kyushu actually and see if I can not get some vlog down there. So that'll probably be, might take me a couple weeks for the next video cause I'm gonna be doing final exams and then I'm gonna be going to Kyushu but I'm planning to get a lot of footage down there so I can make some, some nice vlogs out of the footage down there. And I'm gonna hike to one of Japan's oldest trees, one of the world's oldest trees actually. And if you like this kind of video, please let me know, throw some more comments. Cause I think I'm gonna do more of these photo hunt videos and show you what I do in my free time anyways, and kind of bring you along on that adventure. If you like that idea, like, subscribe, comment, all those good things. Cause that helps me know that you're actually interested in this. And if not, that's okay too. You know, well, I have lots of good stuff planned. Like I said, I'm going to be traveling for the next couple weeks without my laptop after my exams are done, but I'll be bringing some content to you as soon as I can. 
So stick around for that. I can't wait to share with you.